Good morning. Good morning. Aloha. Aloha. Ah. Yeah. Oh, that was good. They even followed my ah. Uh. <laughs> That's when you know you really have your audience, is if they do that. Good morning, everyone. If you don't know who I am, I am Reverend Patrick, and this is the beautiful Reverend. Look how goddess she looks today. <laughs> And speaking of goddesses, there is Carrie Fox. <laughs> and the other wonderful fox, Michael, over there. Ah, <laughs> uh, what a great day. What a great day, Jackie. Yeah. Um, first of all, I want to thank everyone who came out yesterday. Yesterday we had the memorial for Papa Joe. And it was absolutely a wonderful love-filled, sharing experience. And um, I'm sure that Papa Joe, who was probably there, not probably was there, was saying, 
Wow, they did it right. They did it right for me. So we just know that in this philosophy, there's no such thing as death. It's eternal life every moment. So we celebrated his life yesterday. So welcome, welcome again. And um, I would like to bring up the wonderful uh, Michelle LeMay to do our, who also looks very goddess-like today. You're just looking, what is this? What is this? What is this dress? I even wore black pants today. I mean, what's going on here? What's going on? So she's going to do the wonderful announcements for us. And um, we just love you, Michelle, and appreciate you. And she's one of our practitioner students. And she's on the board of trustees. So Michelle LeMay. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Morning. <laughs> well, as always, we have lots of good things coming up today and this week. We will be um, having some more information. We always have an information table. I know we always have new people, so that sometimes it seems like I'm repeating myself for those who come regularly, but it's because we always have new faces and we want everybody to feel included. We do have information table. That's where a lot of the signups are when I talk about the different events. We also have a fabulous bookstore where we have lots of books that's just really powerful. It, it's a way to actually bring the science of mind into our lives on a daily basis, especially with the Science of Mind magazine. You could start off every morning with a reading. There's a different reading every day for um, the whole month, and they're done monthly. So it's something that I've incorporated and really have found it a powerful way to start my morning and to center myself. So feel free to check out the bookstore. We also have some local authors from people who are right in the room with you. So definitely check that out. And then I've been announcing for quite a few weeks now, we have Flying Solo that's going to be starting. It's a six week program to kind of delve into your own story, into your own timeline, into your own life, and then do a one person 10-ish minute play. <laughs> for, for those of you who came and watched, some were a little bit longer than that, but it was all very powerful and transforming. And even a few of the folks who did Flying Solo 1 are doing Flying Solo 2. So that tells you how powerful that is. And that starts this week. So there are three more spots that need to be filled. So if you are teetering, I talked about last week that if you're teetering, make a decision. This is the last chance to make a decision. So definitely talk to the reverends um, or you know one of us who have done it before if you have any questions or you're not sure. But it's definitely a growing experience. And then on Friday, this coming Friday, we have Feel Good Friday with Reverend Diane. If you don't mind standing up so people in the back can see you. No, standing up. Standing up. There we go. Yay. <laughs> Another goddess amongst us. <laughs> and so it will be going, <laughs> it the topic will be living in the flow. And it's all about meditating, discussion, prayers. And it's just a way, again, to incorporate this philosophy into your daily life and kind of set your weekend in a great way. So that is going to be this Friday from 6 to 7. And then next Sunday, after service, is when we're going to have our gatherings, the Mindful Men Treehouse. They're going to be meeting, and they always meet outside somewhere. I don't know where. It's a secret location. They will not disclose it to us ladies. But then the ladies, we meet here, Women in Consciousness Connection, we meet here. And this week, it's going to be, or this month, it's going to be led by Reverend Paula, who's here visiting. And she's going to be facilitating that for us. And I don't see Paula today, but she was here. Oh, <laughs> someone else raised his hand. It's not, it's not Reverend Paula. But Reverend Paula will be <laughs> <laughs> and he doesn't even know it's Louise. <laughs> Surprises all the time. <laughs> and then coming up in September, we'll have some great things happening, but especially our teen group. That's what we're really wanting to get out into the community. They're going to be doing a lot of theater programs with the teens in the community, and they don't even have to be a part of the center as long as they want to come and explore uh, the whole theatrical side and their creativity side. So enjoy your service. Thank you for your kind attention. I was laughing when they were raising their hand. I wanted to say to you, welcome to my world, Michelle. Um, yeah, the, the also, I'm not sure if I heard it, but it's uh, been put um, ahead one week, so it's um, August 24th. I'm not sure if the day, yeah, it's, it was starting this week flying solo. Now it's August 24th. Oh, yeah, I know I've, that memo did not get to you. Ah, so let's all just take a nice deep breath. And let's know that we have been announced. Absolutely. And there's a great announcement going on here, and that is that we are just light beings. And speaking of light beings, we're going to have Michael. We're going to have Michael uh, do our meditation today. So welcome, welcome. Hello, hi everyone. Pump up the volume. Is that what the talk's about today? Yeah. 
walked in these doors and it's already, <laughs> right? Yvette, where's Yvette? <laughs> All right, everybody. <sighs> Let's take a deep breath. Get comfortable in your chairs. Close your eyes if that feels right for you. Sinking into this safe place. Right here, right now. Connect with your heart. Breathing in this perfect moment on this brand new day. Exhaling the thoughts of yesterday. As you continue your divine journey of love, peace, and meditation, I'd like to share a quote that I wrote with you. Earth the mother, the gospel teacher. She sings from the heart and she knows how to reach you. The flame, the fire, your one desire, igniting the passion only you can inspire. From the time a leaf falls from a tree and touches the earth, you can fulfill your entire destiny.
so grateful to know this truth as part of this day today, this time together, knowing that truth into us through everything that we do here, through the listening, through the speaking, through the music, through the singing. It is all that truth ringing in our own ears, in our own way, bringing us back home to ourselves. So I am grateful, and I just let this time unfold, moment by moment by moment, grateful, 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 as I accept it as perfect, as I say, and so it is. Thank you, Michael and Carrie. It was an exceptional. So we're going to take a moment to light our peace candle and to sing a song that I sang last weekend.